Hey guys, so I have a long overdue empties for the months of, I don't know, like I can't remember the last empties I've done, but this has just been built up for a while now. Um, but anyways, it's just a bunch of random stuff. So, and then of course Tootsie, she's wanting to say hello. Little rat. Okay, so we'll start with like candles since I've got some in the floor here. Um, this Living Colors candle, it's Lilac Bloom. And um, this was, I think you can buy these at Big Lots for like five bucks. This candle is pretty good and it lasted forever. And then we have this um, black cherry and sweet berry champagne candles from um, the Dollar Tree. These little things smell really good. A holiday style um, cinnamon candle. This came from, I think, the Dollar Store, Dollar General, or Family Dollar. One of the two. Roxy's in the recliner rocking, and I've got my phone like on the recliner, so I'm hoping it ain't gonna fall. Um, then, let's see, this candle here. This was a um, wood lights candle. Sorry, guys. Um, Roxy, no. And anyways, um, I got this on sale a long time ago for like um, $1.75. I didn't really care much for it. I did like how it sounded, like the crackling sound. So that was sort of different. But I probably wouldn't repurchase that just because um, the smell wasn't all that good. Okay, on to this one here. This one was a candied caramel pecan um, candle from Better Homes and Gardens. This thing here was amazing. I've had this since 2013. I just now got to it and burned it up. Um, I don't know, I've just been sort of over like the, like the fall, like winter scent, so there was like one left, so I just went ahead and burned it to get it out of my collection. To where I can start all over new, guys. Um, let's see, is that all the candles? No, it's not. Then we have this one here. This candle here was amazing. Uh, this is watermelon slices. I got this for four dollars at uh, Big Lots, and this is by the Goose Creek candle. And it had like a clean burn, it was two weeks, so I enjoyed that one, guys. And then the next one here is the, and of course there's stuff all over it. Um, which one was this one? Sweet Lemonade, and it's kind of burnt. Like burnt really bad, but this one was a really good candle too. But I like the watermelon better. And then we have some wax melts here. A couple of them guys. Um, we have the cinnamon and spice. Like, cinnamon's my all-time favorite scent. Like, I love it. And this one smelled just like pure cinnamon. Smelled like the cinnamon sticks. Like, on the picture, it smelled just like it. And those are $2 at Walmart. And then the Sensationals Pumpkin Spice. I got this one on sale, like, a while back. And for some reason, I just reached for it. And then the Luminescence, um... Sweet Peony and Spring Rain. I can't find these anywhere at Dollar Tree. I got these at Dollar Tree and I was hoping to find some because they had like several other ones and for a dollar these had a pretty good throw and they're very strong too. So if you see those, pick those up. And then a I Feel Pretty Poured Fresh. Um, I think it was like a rose or something. I can't remember. Some, um, someone had sent that to me in a giveaway I think. And then cherry vanilla swirl. This one smelled really good too. Very cherry-ish. I love cherry smelling stuff. And then there was this Market Peach um, candle that I've had forever and it smelled really good. This candle here lasted me for a long, long time because I just burned it. Like I would forget about it, put it up there and I would just burn it, you know, whenever. Finally, I'm just like, I'm done with that mess. And then this candle cafe frappe um, ice caramel macchiata. Um, 
these little things are the bomb from Dollar Tree. So again, if you see these little candles, pick them up. I haven't seen them in a while, so I'm not for sure if it was just a one-time thing. But I do like those. Um, and of course, Grace's got her shaving cream going for her slime. Let's see, I think that's all of those. Air fresheners, Alaskan springtime, and this crisp watermelon. This stuff here. What is it, Roxy? Smells so good. And you can find this at the dollar store for a buck. Oh my Jesus, I'm running out of room here. Um, this Mad About You shower gel. Like that pretty well. A yellow raspberry and black sugar doll hand, hand wash. And then, let's see, some Dove pomegranate lemon verbena revive deodorant. That stuff worked really good. And then this Bali mango. There's like enough for like one more use in here. I'm totally done with it. I have used this stuff freaking two weeks, two to three weeks, and I've just totally had enough. I don't know these older scents really like if I'm like I've been trying to use some of the older scents and I don't know they're just really getting on my nerves so this is going garbage I've had enough of it and then this kiss um by pure romance re refreshing body splash this stuff I've had for ages and I finally used it up which I liked it it's got like a plum uh, I don't know what's the name of it it's like a some type of flower I know, but it smells really good. I need to buy some more of this. I haven't been to Pure Romance parties in forever. And then we have the Mahogany Tiki Wood. This stuff's amazing. I've got like a bottle left and I've been trying to find more of it because I've not seen this anywhere. And as soon as it goes online again, I'm gonna be buying at least two bottles of it because this is like my favorite scent from Bath and Body Works. Like it's amazing. And then this uh, Georgia Peach. And sweet tea I love this stuff smells so good use that one up and then <clears throat> I'm so done with this this is the um, I've actually been using this for like a month and a half now like I throw it in my purse there's like this much left um, but I'm done with it so I'm gonna use this for like air freshener I'm gonna give it to Gracie she said she wanted it but I have had enough of it I don't know I've sat and worn this stuff like every single day of my life for the last two months and like off and on and the smell starting to smell different on me so i'm like you know i'm down to the bottom so i'm done now now i get to pick and choose a new scent to put in my purse so done with that mess and then i use up this uh this is the healing garden coconut milk and lime body lotion this stuff is absolutely amazing. I've got the spray to it, and um, it's just a true different scent. Like, it's a very unique scent, and um, you can smell the lime, and you can smell the coconut, but it sort of, you know, levels out. Um, but I like it, and these are like, I can't, like six or seven dollars at Walmart, but these are definitely comparable to Bath & Body Works. Like, if I had to choose from Bath & Body Works in this lotion, I would go for this. A lot of the lotions I can't wear because it's like, even the ones like this are sort of wet feeling to me. I have to use like the cream ones, but this is so comparable to Bath and Body Works. It's unbelievable. Like the texture wise and like how it smells and stuff. And then I used up this clean finish um, Rimmel London foundation. Um, this was in the color, I don't know what the color was, True Ivory. I didn't like it. I mean, it just, it didn't, um, it didn't have enough coverage for me. I tended to find myself putting a lot on just to cover up more, and it made sometimes my face look cakey, so, you know, I was done with that mess. And then there is a lip scrub, coffee and coconut, and I'm not for sure if I've already showed this. It's in the bottom of my thing. But anyways, this was really good stuff. I got this from Ipsy. What you doing, Tootsie? And Roxy girls. 
Um, then there is a Andy Lee Brightening Cleanser that came from Ipsy too, and I have no idea where you can purchase that mess. But anyways, guys, that is my um, empties that I haven't shared in forever. I used to do empties once a month, but I haven't really got to it, and I really hadn't like had enough stuff to do it. So these things are good. If you haven't tried these, I'll get you some. They're awesome. Anyways, guys, talk to you guys later. Bye.